Hi, my name's Brendan, and yesterday I went out, I had the idea I would cook some lamb shanks. So I went down to the supermarket and then got distracted and did some other things. And by the time I got home, it was so late that there's no way that they would, the slow cook would work by, by dinner time. So I'm cooking lamb shanks today. So I'm not a culinary expert, so I use the packet slow cooks. We've got... Garlic and herb lamb shank slow cookers. So this is what we're going to cook. Always start with a nice clean workspace that doesn't have any junk everywhere. We've got headphones, always good when you're cooking lamb shanks. We've got a jaw clip. We've got Super Mario lollies. Not really sure what this is. I think this is Rebecca's Rebecca's headband. I might try it on. Rebecca's headband gives me the Zoolander look. Let's see if we can do blue steel. Anyway, let's get into the lamb shanks. Okay, so I've peeled the carrots. As fascinating as that may be for you to watch me peel carrots, I thought we would start with the, the cutting of the carrots. I think it's best to make your carrots pretty big in a slow cook because otherwise it just dissolves in the cooking process. But not too big because if you've got a small mouth you might um, not be able to fit it in your whole mouth. I guess you could cut it a bit with your knife and fork but who wants to use those? So this is how not to cut carrots. So if you're a really good cook, don't cut carrots like this. We've also got celery. I like to put in all the green, I like the colour green so I put in all the leaves as well, I'm not sure if you meant to do that or not.
I can't stir any better than that. Oops, better turn it on. I've always found it's best to turn on the slow cooker because if you get home and you hadn't, haven't turned it on, uh, it doesn't work out too well. We've all been there, you, you have to admit it, but it looks like it's turned on today, so fingers crossed it's going to go alright. The moment of truth. Ooh. Crikey. We fogged up the lens. <laughs> Steam does do mm -hmm. that. Do you want me to check it and test it? Yes, Open please. Oh, you've done well, love. Thank you. Sorry to all the vegetarians out there. And to all the meat lovers. <laughs> no, that's all going to come off the bone, look. Nice. Oh, I don't want to ruin it. The people like, I don't like the bones on mine. Look at that, that's just come off so easy. Beautiful. Nice, well done, love. Thank you. How spoiled a wife to come home from work to this lamb shanks and veggies. Very nice. Oh, and you're not well. A bit sick. Don't breathe on my lamb shanks. Delish. Mmm, you've done a great job, love. Thank, Thank you. So, yeah. what did you think of the dinner? Uh, not very good. No, no good? <laughs> you ate nearly the whole plate. Hello. Oh, How so do you feel, love? You've slaved over a slow cooker and you'll be told it's, it's basically rubbish. Oh, so what score do you give me, Ark? Yeah. Wait, no, actually five out of four. Five out of four? Yeah. 125%. You, you've done well, though. I know. I'm pretty happy with that result. Uh, Bo, what did you think of it? Um, because I like it. I'll tell you why I like it. I'll tell you why I like it because I had um, this. Yes. And like, yummy. So it was yummy? Mm -hmm. I think it was because it was cooked with love. That's right. No, it had yummy meat and yummy mashed potatoes. I did it. Of, what sort of meat was it? Uh, beef. No. Corn. No. <laughs> Mummy. What? <laughs> Mummy. <laughs> Daddy. <laughs> it was lamb. Lamb chop. Lamb chop. That's a plate the chef likes to see. And the thing I like best about, besides how delicious it was, mm. was that here's tomorrow night's dinner ready to go. I love that because it means that I don't have to cook. Mm. So, not only have you done well today, you've done well tomorrow in advance. So that means I can relax tomorrow? Uh, I'm sure I can find more jobs for you to do. But seeing how you're sick, you might get a day of DVD. Daddy, you can't.